and with that free Dyson DC07 brush control that I picked up a couple of weeks slash months ago, well, here it is. I did give it a full wash and brush up, and it still does remain the best one of these I have actually had, even though it itself is very, 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 very faded. So, give it a crack. We'll run it through the old routine, and we'll see what this free Dyson is like now. Yes, hello my vacuum cleaner chums, how are you today? Yes, the free Dyson, and I'm going to emphasise that point a little bit because it is a little bit pertinent. I've had many comments on all of the Dyson videos that I do saying, wow, I picked one up from on top of a skip and thanks to XYZ, it now works perfectly. And yes, it is that simple. I mean, yes, this is a free, very old incredibly faded Dyson but equally it's a free old faded incredibly old Dyson that was still like 300 pounds when new so it's still you know a 300 pound vacuum cleaner in the sense so if you can pick one up and restore it it's now going to be good for another 20 odd years maybe most of exception but they're only 16 to 17 pounds and I've got videos on that so you, you could have conceivably done this to what we have. Uh, not all fantastic news, not gonna lie. Hose washed up very well. All of the random orange went as well. I've no idea what that was, but luckily it came off incredibly easily. The wand, however, is very faded indeed. It is a bit damaged as well, but it's all in Q bonded. It's gonna be okay. But yeah, very faded indeed we also have fading on all of the chassis if i take off the bin though it is more prevalent we'll see that yeah time is time is never kind to these this is the only problem with these they do fade and when they fade they go really brittle this one is surprisingly good the only actual damage it has is that and they do that very very easily anyway you could have dropped it and it would have done that, or indeed the whole thing could be crumbling apart. And it would also do the same. This is still the cleanest one of these exact colours are the worst that I have seen. And we have a new filter pad. Everything is spotless. No dirt has passed through this yet. The bin, that bin came up quite well. Cam was glossing it up a little bit. But yeah, it's alright. It's better than some I've seen. Here is the filter, it's worrying, is it a hair? It washed up, that's the original filter that was in this machine, everything's original. The only thing that this has had is a replacement clutch because the clutch white wheel, as you know, was trash. And that clutch came out of the Dyson DC27 that didn't make it back to being a Dyson DC27. So, set of belts and a filter, which from eBay cost, if you bought them individually, I'd buy them a bit more bulk, be about three pounds, really. It's fairly worth it. Underneath, yeah, don't want to break it. <laughs> I want to get rid of it after this. Underneath is mint brush roll. It's very clean. The internal hose washed up okay. Went a bit springy. It'll be all right. It'll be all right. So we'll plug it in. I haven't yet found a turquoise dusting brush. And if I haven't got a turquoise dusting brush, I'll just set it with a set of grey tools. Don't worry too much about that. What we will worry about though is how it works. I'm sure I remember how it worked last time. I had to empty it of rubble, I do believe, to get any suction out of it at all. Well, it's a little bit better now. <laughs>
may have gotten smaller and the air pass has certainly gotten smaller and the cyclones may have gotten more but let's be honest this was the genesis that we still are at today they're just more often and smaller as many, as much as other people might wish to disagree with me I mean, it's good don't get me wrong it is a you know, these are pretty dated now but you know I've pulled that out of a pretty tricky to clean rug which was fairly clean anyway and that's not bad happy enough with that yeah this sort of machine in this sort of condition i'm gonna put it up for 50 pounds on the local facebook groups and if somebody offers me 40 pounds and can collect it fairly promptly because i'm doing having a bit of shopping and it'd be nice to do that bit of shopping for free file my time hey it'll go so yeah i wouldn't go mad if you wanted to do a dyson up and make a quick buck doing it with a dc07 at all nowadays i'm justifying it slightly by these videos now because i can earn a little bit of views back that way but yeah if you're actually doing this to make a crust oh, i would skip the dc07 now sadly because it is a really really good one of this color and even it is really really faded so yeah they're not worth it pass them by they're just not worth it unless you can unless you need a motor five pound one of these for its good motor and clutch it's worth it in spares then you're left with all the plastic and that can get quite a lot so yeah until next time this was my free dc07 i hope you've enjoyed and i but not it will see you soon bye bye